Operation Finally Home is coming to Wisconsin for the first time. And we are celebrating our 10th anniversary this year. Uh, last week, we actually dedicated our 91st home. Operation Finally Home, we teamed up with them uh, about a year ago, and we are building two homes in the village of Jackson for disabled veterans. I'm actually here today uh, to be part of this uh, ceremony, but also because we are interviewing candidates for homes. So Drew comes from a family that was entrenched in the military and had a longing to serve our country. He enlisted in the U.S. Army as an infantryman. During his time in service, Robluski deployed to Iraq while in the gunner position providing rear security during a combat patrol. His vehicle came around a corner and suddenly was engulfed in flames from a sharp charged explosion. He had to medically retire from the Army with a number of accolades, including a Purple Heart, Army Commendation Medal, Army Good Conduct Medal, and many more. In May of 2013, Roblowski graduated from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point. He married Caitlin. They were actually next door neighbors, 40 acres apart from each other. They are a wonderful, wonderful couple and they are just one of the couples that we are that we have tirelessly checked out hey, Molly, can i interrupt i'm sorry can i interrupt tim? real quick what's up tim? well you know that's a great story and i think there's a lot of uh people out here that really this resonates with what do you guys think about drew and caitlin getting a mortgage-free home We are all so honored to be a part of this great Operation Finally Home, and David, and myself, and Matt Newman, um, when this all came about, we said this is a no-brainer. This is right in our wheelhouse, and we're so happy to be a part of this, and congratulations again to Drew and Kaylin. I know it sounds cliche, but words honestly can't describe it. I, I, I've never been actually able to say that truthfully until now. It's, it's, it's awesome.